This is bacon. I may have forgotten to defrost the bacon, so we're gonna have to wait a couple minutes. Splash, splash. Juji, do you like bacon? This is bacon, Juji. See that? Yeah. George also likes bacon, but who doesn't really? Bacon is, 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 is a delicious flavor. That's the right answer. We're not supposed to jump on counters, so. Oh, he wants a treat. One second. You want a treat, bud? Yeah, you want a treat. Okay. He's lamb. It's not bacon, but it'll do. Now there is a big debate online of what the perfect piece of bacon is. And I mean, in such crazy times that we live, we must find out, we must know what it is. And so we have a chart. We have this chart right here. Now let's work through it. We have number one to number six. Now, if you are number one, are you okay? Do you need a hug? Should we talk? Do, do, do we need me to call someone? Is this possibly a cry for help? Because that is raw bacon. You should not be eating that. Then we work our way over to number six and very similarly, What's going on here? This is burnt food. You, you, you don't need this. This is, this is overly cooked, okay? Don't do that to yourself. Now, if you tell me three or four, or really anywhere between that, I'm fine with that. That is a good looking piece of bacon. Number two, a little chewy still. Number five, we're starting to get a little crunchy, but three, four, come on. That is the right piece of bacon. Anything other than that, I don't know. I don't know what you're doing. So that's what we're gonna do today. We're gonna aim for three, maybe 3.5, maybe a 3.6. I don't know. Somewhere in this realm is what we're gonna go for. And why are we doing this? Well, I don't feel like doing any of my game development right now, and this is way more exciting. Okay. So we're gonna cook the bacon in a few different ways. We're gonna start with the pan. You know, old reliable. We've all had pan bacon before. It's the best kind. I take that back. We don't know if it's the best kind. It's gonna be the best kind. It's obviously the best kind, but we're gonna figure that out for sure. And next, next, we're gonna do it in the oven. We're gonna bake the bacon. Can you bake bacon? How much bake can you bake bacon if you could bake bacon? I don't know. Anyways, we're gonna bake the bacon. We're gonna see how good that is. Also, we're gonna try a few other ways that I don't think are gonna taste very good, but we, we have to know for sure. We are also going to try and boil it, which I don't know if that's gonna be very good, but let's try it anyway. In the last test, in the pressure cooker. Is this gonna be good? I think so. I mean, I'm pretty sure you can cook meat. Where is it? You cook chicken and fish, so that's it's kind of like bacon. This, this, this one's gonna work. I'm, I feel good about this one. Look at that beautiful piece of bacon going down in the pan. Now, I tell you, this is going to taste so good. We got that next piece of bacon looking fantastic, ready to be baked. All right, let's get it on the pan. We got to get that into the oven and get it cooking. I feel like I'm committing a crime to bacon by putting it inside of a boiling pot of water. And finally, the last piece of bacon has to go inside the pressure cooker. Can you cook it in the pressure cooker? I'm pretty sure. I will say that the bacon boiling reminds me a lot of when I have a bath. It's just flubby meat really warm getting boiled up it's not it's not good it's not a pretty picture so instead of having to see me in a bath you can just you can just look at that instead yeah so enjoy that visual that's for you that's for you to have take away do what do it what you do what you want with that one hello you oh yeah the color we're getting here now we're see it's trying to brown up a little bit nice i like that looks good we're still Okay, so if we look at this one here and this one here, we're kind of like we're kind of like right here at this one. See what I mean? A little browning, kind of like we're maybe here. We got to get to here, here and here. That's where we need to be. This one here. If we look at it. Okay. Still here. Definitely still there. Still there. But we're gonna get there. We're gonna get somewhere nicer with that one. There's literally nothing better than just making bacon, I'll tell you. Okay, this boiled one. This is horrible looking. This does not look appetizing at all. I don't even know how long you have to boil bacon for it to become edible. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna leave it to the very end. This is gonna be really gross. I, I don't look forward to this one, but I'm gonna do it anyway, but I just know that I don't look forward to it. Well, this looks absolutely disgusting, but I do this for you, okay? I do this for you. Okay, I think we're really, I think this one's almost done. Oh yeah, look at that, that, that's that. All seemed to be going well cooking this bacon until something happened. Turns out the pressure cooker had an error and the bacon is kind of messed up now. Okay, so this one I don't think went very well. Just scorched looking bacon at the very bottom. Okay, not great. Okay, the oven one, I think is officially done. It looks really, really good. Oh yeah, look at that. That is a good, that looks good. I think we're there. Let's pull that out. Oh yeah, spilled bacon grease everywhere. That's fantastic. It's finally time to pull out this flubby piece of meat and get it on the plate. 
And yeah, it's you know, it's time. We have all four here. We're set up and I guess we're ready to go. Finally, the part we've all been waiting for. We have our different types of bacon here and now we gotta figure out which one, which one's the best. Now, visually looking at it, I mean, that is horrible looking. Um, that's the boiled one. The boiled one looks absolutely atrocious. I don't even know where to start with that one, but we're, we'll, we'll eat it. The baked looks unreal. The pressure cooker one is literally just crumbs. It's just, it's pure crumbs, but it looks cooked. And then the pan one, the pan looks unreal. So let's start with the one that I'm pretty sure is still this one here, the number one, which is the boiled one. Let's start with that one and we're just gonna, I guess, get to it. Oh my, oh, that is disgusting. Tastes like bacon, kind of, but the texture is horrible. And it's just, it's just, it's just kind of gross. Yeah, that is disgusting. Mm -mm. I'm not finishing that. I can't, that is, that is not good. I did not enjoy that. And I don't think anyone would. That was, that was tough. Okay, on to the baked one. Look at that, beautiful color. It's crispy, it holds itself up. Look at, just look at, Look at the difference between baking it and boiling it. This, this floppy, horrible thing or this delicious looking thing. Very different. It's a good piece of bacon. I'll be honest, that's a good piece of bacon. If we look at it, that's like a number four. That's like a perfect, a perfect four. That's a good piece of bacon. Oh man, it's a good piece of bacon. I like that. I like that a lot. Mm. The remnants of the pressure cooker. Just kind of, just kind of tastes really weird. Like, just like bacon, just like underwhelming bacon. I will say, that is still better than this, finally. The real reason we're here, the pan bacon. That, now, let me tell you, that's a beautiful piece of bacon. Let's get, let's look at our chart here. That's like a perfect, perfect three, four. A perfect three, four bacon. That's what we're here for. This is what we want. Perfection. That is the perfect piece of bacon. You know what? This bacon is so perfect. It is so perfect that I have a feeling that if I make a perfect, if I get a little sandwich with the disgusting piece of bacon, I put the perfect bacon next to it, it's still gonna taste good. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That bacon is so good. That is so good that made this horrible one taste actually okay. The results are easy here. It's clearly pan bacon, number one, and it's not even close. Followed by oven, number two. Pressure cooker did not finish the race. We're gonna leave it there. And then boiled bacon. Don't do that unless you actually hate yourself. I really need to get back to game dev. Catch you next time.